potential. Usual. Sausage or mushroom? Is it bad? Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That actually brings us over 400, which is insane. So we've got Disney games. I think I have to tweet that we're going to Disney games. All two of them. It's going good, Super Sonic. We're playing video games. Diapers are being paid for. Jam Eveler, thank you for the raid. We just missed Zelda. It's probably good you missed Zelda. I, I may have had to leave level 9, find a letter, and get a prescription to go back to level 9. It's not something I'm looking to remember anytime soon. But welcome to the stream. We're gonna throw crates now instead. Yeah, it was... It definitely was a thing that happened. I might be picking up the health at this point. I have not played this game in an, probably since the one-day tournament that they had on RGL for this game. So you might have to excuse some pretty rusty play. This game is, is fast and furious. That is entirely a marathon strat to pick up that acorn. Because in theory, you just don't get hit. In theory, there's a lot of damage boosting you can do here like that. And I'm just playing it very safe right now. After what just happened. Okay, let's go. The first stage is actually probably the hardest because it's one really long room. And once you're in here, it's not that bad. Everything gets easier after room one. And the trick is to hold B. The problem is I need to hold B until I catch it and then immediately throw it. So that was kind of mediocre. Just like every other run today where it's... I haven't played this game in a long time. But it's fun. Oh boy, here we go. Oh my... I will take that at this rate. I'm getting thrown off by this duck button. D-pad, what is going on? see if we can get any doubles. Chippendale Rescue Rangers is a really good game and you should play it. It's also like a short game. So 
so basically, uh, I don't think there's any real RNG for the stages themselves. I think there's a little bit of boss RNG now and again. So most of it is deciding which intentional damage boost you want to take. And then it's all execution. Like, I should not have taken that hit there. So if you're going, like, record pace, right, you take every damage boost you can. Oh, wow, we're still in this. Yo, Supersonic, thank you so much. I missed the damage boost there. I will see what you wrote in the message in a moment. I have to figure out how to get the m messages on screen. I've never actually tried to set up the stream alerts for something like this, so... It's been a little bit of educational experience today. hits in here. Here's something for Little Baby Cab. Thank you so much, dude. And Twilight, thank you for the host. two damage boosts, but I got one boost. This whole stage is just get the screen up as high as you can. Pizza has been ordered. Craigasm indeed. I don't know if I'm going to have pizza in my future. I don't know how much you were listening earlier. Sausage or mushroom might be the order of the day. Hmm. My problem in this game is just learning the actual strats instead of kind of faking the strats. Although when I'm really grinding this game, I tend to be able to go pretty well with it. Looking Toad, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Cat Fleet. Hope you enjoy the ride. Welcome to the stream. Dang. Yo, there's health there? Cool. I'm just gonna take this box with me. Wow. Really, game? It's over. Well, it was over as long as that B was going to keep showing up. Easy, boss. Sausage, mushroom, and green pepper. Nice. I love that typo.
Pumba plays a lot of uh, Mega Man ROM hacks. So if you like that kind of thing, definitely suggest you follow him. What is it? Rockman No Constancy? The Rockman 2 hack he's got record in now? That's what I think I'm divining from reading chat today. Yo, I should probably play Super Adventure Island 2 again at some point. I was debating playing it today. Felt like it might be the right thing to do. But, uh, sellout mode was engaged when you get down to it. Oh my goodness, really? All right, let's do that entire screen again. That's where PBs go to die in this game. You inevitably miss like one jump like that. The 23rd? Jam Evilers in doing the donation drive on the 23rd. What's going on? This time, no problem with that jump. I thought about it. Fun fact about this game, your iframes, like, wear off immediately. Which is to say there is no, like... A grace period when it wears off for you to get off of spikes. It's just over. Also, this final stage music. Zelda week. Can play it a little safe here. Let's get in here. Fat Cat, you almost expect to die like as soon as you get in. This game. There, it's over. Mad Mega! What's up, dude? Welcome to the end of Chippendale. That could have gone better. But it wasn't bad. It wasn't bad. Shouts to stay hydrated, bot, I guess. Ugh.
Yo, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Cat Fleet. Hope you enjoy the ride. Do this. This is a game that I'm really hoping I remember how to get through the mansion. According to the to the schedule, this game started ten minutes ago, so I guess I should get going. Oh wait, 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 wait. Let's do this properly. Gotta open the split file, which lives somewhere on here. It it does do I not? I don't. Okay. Okay. Uh, close this. We can save that. I love that it just goes to that blue thing for a little bit. And then as soon as I type in a game name, it, like, expands back out. What, what are the split names here? Amazon. Okay. Okay, now we can play the video game. Yo, Jam. Thank you so much for the 1510. I feel like I need to ask what that number means. But either way, everything is welcome right now. There we go. Yo. <laughs> Four, three, two, one. Nice. All right, let me let me beat up a mouse. Yo, we did it. Diapers need to eat. Four, three, two, one. Let's go. Thank you so much, Jim. All remaining. They might have to be. Diapers need to eat. It's gross, but it's true.
game. Alright. You know, this long fade in here. Just to go back to the start of the stage. I don't think I've ever died on that bridge before. I've also, though, never tried to walk across it. What a day. I'm not asking questions. I was hoping for a little bit of ice cream. What's up, BR man? There is a link act it's the E tank link below the stream. Maybe I should just make that exclamation point donate a thing. Where am I, where am I doing this? I guess it fade out right now. Money going towards diaper and kids' college fund. This is not where I talk to you. <laughs> Thanks, BR man. Ow. Is it the, I think it's the right mirror. Hopefully I'm not wrong. That's the one. I'm pretty sure I had a playthrough just for funsies a couple of weeks ago to make sure I knew what I was doing in this game. And I took the left one every time, and it was very wrong. That's what I was afraid of. Yo, Dragoon. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Cat Fleet. Hope you enjoy the ride. Am I going to game over? This is already proving to be very bad. This is... I thought it was easy. Maybe it is normal. Yo, Mad Mega, thank you for the bits. The continued overwhelming support. Thank you. 
Let's just get it, right? This run's already not going well. Might as well get the fun, the swag. Okay, that's why I shouldn't get it, because I got way too much money. Yo, BR man. Woo, congrats. Thank you for the $25. I feel like it's almost too much money here. Baby Cab's got a good start. All land clear. Dialogue isn't even updated. Or are we talking about DuckTales too much money? Baby Cab needs a money bin. That's not good. I practice swimming somewhere. I think there are strats to basically get extra hits in faster, but given the lack of extra lives. We're just going to take this nice and easy, beat the video game. Except for that. That is not a PB by a long shot, I'm fairly certain. I really hope it's not. Look, he's so happy. Yeah, I have an 8.53. Okay. Well, now I have splits the play against at least. That's a good start. Scrooge remains richest duck in world. This is somehow front page news.
Hooray for the two Disney games that were on the schedule. I think I gave myself 15 minutes on the schedule for this because I didn't know what was going to happen, and I'm glad I did because it took 11 and a half. Granted, there were a pair of stupid deaths in there, so... If there were rumors going around that he was broke, that would be news. That's true. Alright. I've got Contra, and then the fun begins. Contra is fun. Apparently, before we even do that, we're going to have cart cleaning. Please hold. This is what happens when you don't, like, use your carts enough. Inevitably. This one doesn't even feel that dirty. Kind of weird that nothing's... That wasn't working. I'm leaning towards the cart if only because everything else has been working. It would be weird if the 72 pin connector was going bad and we used how many NES games today and they all worked. Welcome to Contra. Oh, I have to actually still save this thing. Save save the ducktail splits over there. It's been a while. I think I remember how this game works, though. Contra's not a game you really forget how to play. This is interesting. He's not going to make that jump to dodge the fire. This controller has just been very interesting today. Good. No capture, start over, you're right. Oh my goodness. I do that way too much. I turn it off because it's like flickering blue and it's like, oh well, whatever. Sorry about that, we're back. Yeah, I have taken them apart and used the pencil eraser before. It does work to just kind of get things started though.
So fortunately, nobody saw how bad it was. What's the Konami code? Why would I ever randomly push up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A, start on the title screen of this game? It, it seems like cheating if I do that. It's gonna give me like 30 lives or some nonsense. You know, we, we don't need that. Contra is not a game you can really look away from easily. That's the only problem right now. It's like Dorimon. You put in a password and then you beat the game. I guess that's true. It doesn't make it any faster until you run out of lives. Dying's inherently slower, but you might have to continue or something. I mean, if I run into trouble, we can Konami code the run back. I don't have the rhythm down, because, like... People have probably seen somebody play uh, Contra before on a speedrun setting. You somehow get it, right? Every time you push B, the spreader fires 10 shots. I want these gone right now. So what you want to do is set it up so you can get the rhythm to fire a stream of single bullet shots. <laughs> I am 34 and I'm going on 5, it's true. For a little while, like, you know what it is? This goes back to something I was saying earlier. For a little while, I was resisting the name Cabathon because it's like everybody's thing is something a thon. Get out of here. But then the more you think about it, there is no good name for what you're doing. So you might as well just give in and make it something a thon. Let's go. This might just be proving I can still beat Contra more than I can still speed do anything relatively fast in Contra. Yo, that extra shot. Diaperthon. How did I, get, like, at all have a reasonable time through stage two? That doesn't make any sense either. Whatever. We're playing Contra.
Wasn't hitting the le middle, the left middle one at all. Ugh. Let's keep it going. Oh, I've got a little bit of the rhythm going here. And it's gone. Go. We got the glitch. It's a good glitch. It's a good glitch. Things in like PB attempts, you just go. I need to go back and actually watch the two player Contra run from GDQ because, as much as I was talking about co op runs earlier, I just never. I, I, I keep forgetting to find the time to watch that one. Double mash in his face. Not the worst snowfield. Not falling straight down. Is that food ordered? Oh, never mind. Okay.
randos. That was a terrible position. I should have gone back and just gotten the invincibility. Low percent strats. And that's what happen what what happens when you don't get the invincibility. Well, this is worse. I mean, I guess it works for that. Sorry, Chancenator. You're bad at some video games. Alright. Uh, give, give me a minute, I can help out with it. Contra is like one of these legendary difficult games. It's actually not that bad because everything is just a pattern. The game's biggest trick is like this where it surprises you. But like once the surprise is gone. It's largely done. Yo, know, we're already over, but that's fine. We're gonna beat Contra. Stop shooting because all I heard was the doo -doo. for a second. I thought that was it. That was the last, it's the last item in the game. Forget the last spreader in the game. Evening of Vague Planet. Welcome to the Contra ending. I've got to get the SNES out and make sure I'm set up for a Super Metroid in a moment. Be right back with that.
Thank you. 